morning guys okay so this is gonna be a slightly different video than I usually do I'm still gonna do that room tour in fact I'm gonna film it next but since I'm sure some of you are gonna need like a cosplay or whatever wig at some point I figured I would do a long overdue review of my absolute favorite wig that's in my collection I'm going to have to look it up on my phone and see what the name of it was. But it's this one, which you might recognize as my kind of uh, Hannah Montana-ish wig. I did have like an actual licensed Hannah wig, but I'm getting rid of that because that's beyond repair. Okay, um, hold on just a second. And I'll put the link for this in the description. I think I got it in 2016. Um, oh, yep. Okay. So this is called the... Star Power Straight Hair Honey Blonde Wig with Bangs. And it's by Loftus. There's a picture of it. So, honestly, I was expecting something a little bit longer from looking at this picture. But, I must admit, this is a good length. Because if I hold it up, it like hits right about at my chest, which is a good thing. And it has little highlights in it, so it looks like it kind of could be real if it wasn't so gosh darn shiny. And the good thing that I've noticed with this wig is you can brush it a lot and it won't fuzz out like other synthetic wigs do like my Hannah Montana wig that ugh, that turned out very badly and this wig you can comb it out I don't know if you can straighten it or not I haven't tried I've been too scared to <laughs> but you can definitely comb it out without worrying about it turning into a big fuzzball okay now as of right now this wig is 2111 I believe I got it for cheaper. Yeah, I got it for eleven forty four. Don't know what happened. But But it's a really good quality wig. It looks really good. Like hold on, let me give you a visual in case any of you didn't see my wigging out video, which I would definitely suggest you go check out. And I'm going to have to do an updated one soon, because I got rid of a couple, and I'm getting a new one. Well, actually, a few new ones. Okay, so ignoring... Well... Okay. I was going to say, ignoring my bangs sticking out from under it, but I fixed it. Okay, so here's what the wig looks like on. It's a good length. It actually feels, like, really soft. The only problem is there's not as much hair in the back of the wig as there could be, so there's kind of little tiny gaps. You could probably fix that. But, yeah, so that's the wig. I call this my Hannah wig because if there are any Hannah Montana fans out there, remember in Season 3 she had the shorter wig, and this looks like that. And it has the highlights like her wig did. So, yeah. So, that's my Hannah wig. It's more expensive now than when I got it, and I don't know why. But still, it's a really good quality wig for what you pay for it. So, if any of you need a long, or long-ish, blonde wig for anything, then I would definitely suggest you go get this one. And like I said, I'll put a link in the description so you can just go right to it. Okay, I'm gonna go 
dehanify myself and film my room tour video. And I love you all, and hopefully I'll be doing the uh, singing with noise canceling headphones challenge soon. I don't know how soon, but I'll... That hair is really bugging me. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, I'll try to get it out as quickly as possible. This should be interesting. Alright, I love you all. See you in the next video.